we take a look at Longview with our tower cam, we are seeing some mainly clear skies out there. Temperatures right now in Longview at 39 degrees, dew point of 36. So the air is dry and cold out there. It's a cold start to our day today. So grab the heavier jackets as you step out the door this morning. Uh, but again, make sure to wear something a little bit lighter underneath those jackets because by the afternoon, by around 3 o'clock, our high temperatures today are going to be in the lower 70s. And when you factor in the sunshine as well, it may help it to feel a little bit warmer than it actually is out there. So just a warm day overall in store for us. We have high pressure settling in right on top of us in East Texas, and that has allowed winds to calm down this morning, which has also allowed for some fog to develop primarily in deep East Texas. So uh, make sure to leave some extra time to get to your destination through about 9, 10 o'clock in deep East Texas in case you do see that fog around. As the high pressure system drifts off to our east, it will allow southerly winds to return to the area and help warm us up for the rest of the this week again by Wednesday, which is the first day of December, not going to be feeling anything like uh, the last day of the, uh, the last month of the year. We're going to see highs in the mid 70s by Wednesday for today. Your bus stop forecast 7 o'clock this morning. Be in the lookout for some patchy fog in deep east Texas. It will be cold out there. Temperatures in the upper 30s for the most part. Some of us also in at the mid 30s as well, especially in deep east Texas. By noon, temperatures are in the middle 60s, though. We'll see lots of sunshine. And then by your 3 o'clock hour, again, it's going to be a lot warmer out there uh, with those high temperatures climbing in it to the lower uh, 70s for us. As we head into your day on Tuesday, clouds will increase thanks to southerly flow bringing in the cloud cover. We'll also see a weak disturbance moving in from the south. Now this is going to be moisture starved as it moves on in, so we're not expecting any precipitation out of here. But as we head into your day on Tuesday, we will see the clouds increase a bit. We'll call it partly cloudy overall. At this point, again, like I said, we are going to be dry with this uh, weak disturbance. And so that's pretty much it for the rainfall for the month of November. Again, tomorrow's the last day of November. No rain in the forecast. So we have run some rainfall deficits for the month of November. Uh, under an inch, though, below average for Tyler, but just over an inch in uh, Longview and Lufkin. Again, below average for uh, this month. So certainly do still need that rainfall out there. And then we will get some rain, thankfully, heading into the weekend. Your seven day forecast now. We are going to climb to the mid 70s as early as tomorrow. December 1st is Wednesday. It's going to be a high of 75. Rain returns by the end of the week and into the weekend. For Deep East Texas, again, areas of patchy fog through about 9, 10 o'clock this morning, and then some more areas of fog through 9 o'clock in the morning on Tuesday. And then rain returns Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. 